Well, this is Rob Smith. Robbie, a few minutes yesterday, I used a microphone and decided that was a little loud. This a little seems to soften the blow of my voice. So I'm quieter today, I believe. All right, it's uh, it's uh, um, what was I doing? I forget now. Uh, I, I, but uh, the mermaid, mermaid and ducks. Thank you, Tony Petri, uh, Judy Dickerson. I'm probably going to push your request to Sunday or Monday. I'm going to take requests from FP Florida Parent Educators Association children tomorrow to do and Saturday and maybe even the event I'm doing in Jacksonville for on Sunday. So I'll probably do yours on Monday. We'll see. Let's see what happens. In the meantime, we have a duck to do. I want to see what I can do about involving ducks. Let's do something. So something I uh, was thinking about. It's a little. It's certainly different from. Um, and by the way, uh, uh, Tony, or if any of you all would like the drawings that you contributed to, they're yours. Just ask Tony. I hope to see you at the fish fry in June. Really going to try to be there. Right now, things look good to do that. I also need to get out there. I, what I may do, Tony, is actually hike over in the. Uh, since this is out near the Ocala National Forest. Gonna try to get some hiking in very hot temperatures. Maybe it'll be raining. Then I can really have some fun hiking. I need to get outside. It's such a lousy job because we're basically out of hiking season now. And I'm drawing this freehand entirely. There's no pencils here. I just have white space and I'm filling it up and I'm trying to use parameters. A lot of folks drawing mermaids. A lot of folks who draw mermaids coming out of the water. Draw it like their hair is been blown dry. They take that cod air and they've blown that hair somehow before they came out of the water, which doesn't. So actually their their water their hair is should be dripping down with water. This is the first time I've drawn more of a regular mermaid here, I think. This is the fifth drawing. First one I did a kitty. Of course, cats always. Okay, that arm's a little, little off. Actually, I got some. My shoulder is my shoulder in here. I hope not. Oh, you can't really see. I'm gonna just do any. You're just gonna let me. No, what? Okay. Back this up just a little bit. I'm trying to see if I can make this a little smaller. Well, well, I can get it bigger. I can't get small. Yes, I can get smaller. Okay, that gotta work. Hold on. What am I time doing here? I'm at 4:46. I want to try to get these down in five minutes.
think my hair a little darker just to give more of a sense of wetness. Little drips in the water here too. I'm not so your hair's gonna be dripping everywhere. Oh, ooh, I'm getting into six minutes, I think, you know, if I'm clocking this in my head correctly. And I still have to do this. Tomorrow may be a little longer video only because, and I may do that, I may be able to do that live, let's see. It's so hard to do anything inside that hallway at the, uh, and not the only one dripping, but this duck would be dripping too, wouldn't he? Wet duck. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm getting in the way. I'm getting in the way of the camera. I apologize. I try not to. Watch where you float. Get a little bit darker in here someplace. Let's just to get a little bit more depth to it. Okay. All right. I'm at seven minutes now. I guess I oh, almost eight. All right. Real quick signature. Oh, I hope this is interesting. So tomorrow we'll be at Florida Parent Educators Association annual Florida homeschooling convention, and I will take suggestions from some little people and do something involving a mermaid. So this is mermaid for Mar May uh, the 23rd, no, 24th, I'm sorry, May 24th, 2018, and I will see you later. And I'm sorry, I got over eight, eight minutes. See you, see you, hopefully, I'll probably do this long tomorrow. See y'all later, bye.